Hey guys, we're downstairs in the basement at Amy's house looking at doing a furnace replacement. Um, and so for this system, we're going to pull this furnace out. We'll set our new one back in the same location. It'll be a B-width furnace to match the coil that we put in last year. Um, we're going to put the furnace up on top of a six inch base, and then we'll probably use some little cork pads to get it up a couple more inches. Um, what we got going on right now is 41 inch height from the floor to the bottom of our coil. Um, so the 34 inch furnace with a six inch base should match up perfectly. Tie back into all the existing drain lines that are here on the floor. And then gas line will need to be reworked a little bit. There is a shutoff valve here for the gas line, um, but it's currently running in the flexible conduit for the gas and that can't be done. So we'll rebuild that. And then there's currently two inch PVC pipe that goes to the exterior for exhaust. We'll just rebuild that back into the new system. Um, we could add an intake if we wanted. Um, we'll just run that off the top of the furnace and up and out to the outside. Um, and it'll just be a two pipe system. And drains are right there on the floor. Um, we could do our five inch media cabinet with the furnace. There's enough space there between the furnace and the, uh, the furnace and the system. So we'll do a 20 by 25 by five inch filter. And that's pretty much everything. So it should be pretty straightforward thanks to whoever installed the air conditioner last year.